Good morning, everybody. Anthony Rodriguez here, Walking Crow for the Transformational Sacred Drum Medicine. Happy Thursday. You made it to the gateway to the weekend from the holiday. <laughs> from the holiday. Oh my gosh, how many of you have survived the, uh, the, war, on, uh, the war on animals and the war on uh, hearing and the war on uh, anxiety and you know, all that stuff? Survived yesterday, the 4th of July. You know, uh, I guess independence is blowing your ass off. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, welcome to the Gateway. Welcome to Thursday. And I want to thank everybody. Hey, Vicky, how are you? Uh, Rita, um, how's everybody doing today? It's uh, it's Thursday and we're still, you know, kind of midweek. Gwendolina, good morning. Uh, Carmelo, buenos dias. And, um, you know, uh, we're coming into the weekend and uh, the the uh, Fourth of July was symbolic of the really the beginning of summer, beginning of the solstice, beginning of of um, what can be freedom for you and independence, and independence and freedom from what you know. And I like to talk about in, independence and freedom from the old self, from the old tapes, from the from the upbringing that we had that sometimes wasn't very fun or wasn't very good for a lot of us. You know, we, um, as adults, we've lived, we've lived with a lot of trauma. We lived with a lot of hurt. We lived with a lot of pain. And I myself um, don't have to do that anymore. And I refuse to do that. Uh, I, I, I kid around by saying that I'm no longer uh, Buddhist because uh, I no longer am willing to suffer. <laughs> and I won't allow myself to suffer, not at the hands of my of myself, not at the hands of somebody else, especially not at the hands of somebody else, because people can be pretty vicious, people can be pretty mean, and we see that in the news every day, locking up children, separating parents from children. We see that with people mocking people with um, disabilities and just being plain nasty, hating people of a different color, of a different source, of a different... Uh, of a different culture, you know, when and it's all come from fear, and they don't understand how. So I want you to understand that I no longer live in fear. I no longer walk in fear. I walk in the power of who and what I have always been. I walk in the power of what they tried to take away from me. What they not, what they tried to not let me be as a child growing up. A whole. Do you stand in the power? of who and what you are. Do you stand in your feet? Do you stand in the foundation, a solid foundation? Or are you a tree that can get knocked down by the four winds? And what are your four winds? Fear, resentment, anger, poverty, you, you name one, you know, abuse. You know, what are your four winds? And how do you combat those things? And not even combat them. How do you accept them into your life? Because they're a part of your life and they're not going anywhere. How do you accept them into your life and allow yourself to live with the traumas that happened to yourself, happened in your life in a good way? Oh. Uh, in the anonymouses, and my friend Jerry uh, just checked in, um, they we talk about uncover, discover, discard. You know, and I'm I'm a firm believer in uncover, discover, embrace. Do not discard anything because if it lives in the Akashic memory, if it lives in the soul, it's not going to go anywhere. We are not going to get rid of it. It's not going to go go anywhere. So rather than let it haunt us and dog us for the rest of our life and us try to figure out how we're going to live with this thing, which, which gives us anxiety, which gives us pain, which gives us hurt, which allows us to not live our full life, allow yourself to uncover what it is, discover how it made you feel, and embrace that feeling because once we become empowered or once we surrender to that thing, um, we become empowered over it. And it, ha it no longer holds any power to us or for us, a whole. It no longer makes our life hard or difficult if we're willing to embrace it and understand that those things aren't happening anymore. And the only place they happen is the stinking thinking of the darkness, of the, of the goo of the brain. This is not the mind. This is the brain. This is the thing that sends a spark to the pistons that turn the wheels, that make our arms move, that make our mouth move. It's this, this isn't where we get ideas from. Our ideas come from out here in the mind, in, 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 the, uh, in, in the soul, in the Akashic memory. Oh, this is where ideas come. 
not up here. This is the escape hatch right here. So come out of the gu and into ru, into the into the light of your soul, the light of your fire, your fuego. I can, I will, I do, I am. And know your place on earth. Aho. Create your place on earth where they tried to take away your place on earth. Aho. Like they're trying to do right now in the political landscape. Aho. They're trying to take away many of our places on this earth. And guess what? We are weeds and we will grow wild. And that's the way it is. Aho. So saying that, if you feel like you've been traumatized and you've been going through some stuff um, and you don't know how to deal with it, give me a call at area code 818-442-1717 or send me an email at anthony at sacreddrummedicine.com. Go to my website at www.sacreddrummedicine.com and learn more about what it is that I do or let's have a personal conversation. You can learn a lot from these videos, but we can learn more about each other by talking and conversing and communicating in a good way, I hope, all right? So, saying that, welcome to Thursday, and um, you know, I'm glad you survived the 4th of July, the, the fool of July, and this is my left hand, this is the hand of divine feminine, this is the hand of duality, this is the hand of receive it, it receives, I hope. This is my right hand, my hand of divine masculine, it's the hand of giving, the hand of manifestation, it moves forward, it gives to the divine feminine, I hope in a balanced and good and balanced way. I hope. I want you to take your left hand. I want you to place your left hand on your heart, feet flat on the floor, and I want you to take a breath. Inhale. And exhale. Receive that energy through your feet, up and through your cosix, up through your second chakra, into the water, your emotion, up through your fi fire, your third chakra, your fuego, I can, I will, I do. Allow it to rise up again into your heart space. Breath, air. I love, I'm loved, I hope. And I want you to take your right hand. Take your right hand and place it over your left hand, left hand over heart. And I want you to create that connection of love, uh, uh, create the circle of love, completing, completing the circle of love for self, from self, from Mother Earth, I hope. And I want you to repeat after me. I am where love lives. And I am what hope looks like. Repeat, I am where love lives and I am what hope looks like. Again, I am where love lives and I am what hope looks like. Repeat, I am where love lives and I am what hope looks like. One more time, I am where love lives and I am what hope looks like. Repeat, I am where love lives, and I am where what hope looks like. A whole. Remember that you are the hope that's mirrored to others. They're the hope that's mirrored to you. Be where love lives. I am where love lives. You are where love lives. And be the hope that you're looking for. I am the hope that you are looking for. And with and together as community and as, as a conscious community, we can get a lot done and we can do a lot and we can heal our community and the surroundings uh, and our surroundings. I don't know why I'm getting lost here, but it doesn't matter. So I want everybody to have a great Thursday. Uh, we're coming into the weekend. You know, it's only Thursday. Walk, don't run. I know a lot of times people are in a hurry to get to Friday so they can have their two glasses of wine that lead to two bottles of wine that lead to two days of misery so they can back get to Monday and start that cycle all over again. Break the cycle. End the cycle. You don't have to live that way in the cycle of misery. Aho, aho. You don't have to. Put your hand over heart, right hand over left hand over heart, and create a different kind of cycle. Create a circle of cycle of breath and energy and healing for yourself. Become he or she that is love and that is where love lives and become he or she that looks like hope, that becomes what hope looks like. I wanna thank everybody for coming. Anthony Rodriguez, Walking Crow for the Transformational Sacred Drum Medicine saying, have a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day.